Well, Uganda police has finally answered the question on whether they are going to arrest Speaker Jacob Bolanya's father, that is a Mr. Lokori. Yes, I have the details right here. Mr. Enanga has told us what they are going to do in this case. But uh, for starters, subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, recently, uh, President Museveni, while at Kololo, ordered for the arrest of all people who said that Jacob Olanya was poisoned. Uh, President Museveni also said that this indiscipline of some people cannot be tolerated on social media. Actually, his directive came after the minister of ICT, that is Chris Bariomusi, had confirmed that the late Speaker of Parliament, Jacob Olanya, died of cancer, not poison, as some people had circulated it on social media. Now, the latest news is that uh, police has said they are going to start arresting those people after the burial of uh, the late Speaker of Parliament, Jacob Olanya. So, if you know that you circulated the news that the big man was poisoned, my friend, get ready. After the burial, you're going to be picked all the way to Chitalia prison. <laughs> yes, you're going to be taken to Chitalia prison. However, Fred Nanga was also questioned whether they are going to arrest Jacob Bolanya's father, Mr. Lokori, uh, since he's one of the people that sparked the claims of poison. But uh, Fred Nanga said they are going to look into all that after the burial. So basically, the arrests will happen after the burial of the big man, the late Speaker of Parliament, Jacob Bolanya. Now, in other news, Ugandans on different social media platforms have expressed caution after having a look on the barrio budget that is 2.5 billion yes ugandans are like you guys 2.5 billion to be spent this is a lot of money this is a lot of money my guys anyway i just want us to look briefly at the budget for example a plus is going to be given 226 million uh the finance committee will be given 248.7 million uh talk about the actually members of parliament they'll be given 312.9 million then security that is uh 158.5 million on the barrio day they will spend 1.1 billion now that one they didn't break it down we don't know what entails 1.1 billion but uh people are complaining about the 226 million uh, for a plus people are questioning that 226 million for a plus is for what uh is for what now uh, the finance committee will also be given money uh that is a 248.7 million but also the members of parliament from acholi 312.9 million for what so I think the government of Uganda really needs to come out and explain to Ugandans why all this money to be spent. Because, you know, people are saying that all this money, if it is put together, actually a very nice hospital can be constructed in northern Uganda, but not just spending money like this. Because at the end of the day, you never know, some of this money is a taxpayer's money. Yes, yeah, so really Ugandans need serious explanation on this money. And I hope the Minister of Presidency, that is Babalanda, will come out and explain more on this money yes so that is the latest right here on the buzz ug i'm telling you to subscribe in case you haven't and uh, tap on the bell for all the notifications thank you